If the Tories want headlines about a new Iron Lady, they're not very subtle about it. Theresa May came to inspect the steam and sparks in Newport. Must be doing something right, she joked. She needs to, to achieve a big if, turn Wales into Tory territory. It's audacious to pop up in rock-solid Labour land at the start. She was only with activists, with friends, but her appeal is to you. Give me a mandate to lead Britain. Give me a mandate to speak for Britain. Give me a mandate to fight for Britain and give me a mandate to deliver for Britain. She would not be drawn, again, on whether she will raise or lower taxes. How far are you willing to go to grab seats in parts of the country that until now have been Labour heartlands? So I will be out and about around the country uh, in all sorts of areas, all parts of the country, taking this message, a vote for me and a vote for the local Conservative candidate is a vote to strengthen our hand in the Brexit negotiations. Really? From coast to coast? Taking places like Perth Call would mean taking lifelong Labour voters, like Brian and Ira, who've almost decided to do it. It's the first time ever if I do it. First time ever. Because the valleys are yeah. Labour ones. You know, Labour stronghold, isn't it? I'm on the border, really. But uh, I voted for out in the referendum. So I don't know whether to vote Labour or Conservative this time. Yeah, I'm running from up the valley. My father would spin in his grave. <laughs> I work in the colony. <laughs> I'm a typical um, Labour voter, but whether I'll be voting Labour this year because I've got no confidence in Corbyn. But there again, I don't think I'll be voting for Conservative. I'd put the same effort and thought into the way I voted as I did last time. And would you tell me how you did vote the last time? I voted Labour last time. What about father and son, the Edwards, taking the sea air? As you said, he's been Labour all his life. Uh, I think he'd prefer, he prefer he's swung now to Theresa May now or Dad him with the last oh, last couple of years of him. Definitely. Yeah. She absolutely wonderful. Mr. Corbyn. Bye bye. Here, Labour's in charge in Cardiff, but even their leader admits Jeremy Corbyn has some way to go. To prove himself as a leader and to prove himself as somebody who can be, as it were, Labour's candidate for uh, Prime Minister. Uh, we have some weeks to go before the uh, poll itself, but uh, that is the challenge. And even from the start of their campaign, Plaid Cymru won't hesitate to stir up old memories. If people uh, are considering voting Conservative, then I would ask them to remember the past. The Tories have been no friends to Wales. We are not rolling over for any Tory to take our seat. So we are here, we're going to be out in force. It's early days, but any day on the campaign trail is precious. Leaders only turn up to places where they think they're in the game. With possible gains in Wales and in Scotland too, Theresa May is not just contemplating a Tory majority, but hoping to make true her claim there are no Tory no-go areas. Brexit might have redrawn the map, but she wants to colour it blue. I have to reply to my letter, Prime Minister. Yet as she swept away reminders for Theresa May, it won't be easy. Here or anywhere else, the Tories can't be sure they'll always be welcome. Laura Kunzberg, BBC News, Bridgend.